Greetings, YouTube. You are staring at the very bizarre bug on the right side of the screen that several of you have reached out to me today asking if anybody else has experienced this. And as far as I know, so far, everybody who's reached out to me has reported it as an iOS issue, aka they have a iPhone. That doesn't mean that there couldn't be some Android phones that are uh, not experiencing this, but at the same time, this is all that I've heard from on my end. So it's a really, really weird bug that can be repeated like Doctor Strange coming to bargain with Dormammu because you can see from this summoner screen that he has access to both the shard based quest and the rank up materials quest at the same time. He has Guardian Fortitude and the Iron Will. And every time he tried to select one, his game would crash, but when he went into his inventory, it would still show up. So even though you select something just once for the quest to be available, so it's not like the inventory number means anything, it's still super crazy weird that when you look at his inventory, he has 31 of one and one of the other for a total bug crash number of 32. <laughs> I, I really don't know what else to say about that in, in terms of uh, craziness, just that whenever I hear from people who say, Prof, is it just me? Am I the only one who's experiencing this? Clearly this is not the case. Kabam on the forums has uh, made known that they're well aware of this, but he said that he wanted to do the shard-based one the entire time, which I do believe is the reason why he selected it 31 times. And so what he's done is he's already completed 100% of the shard one, but he has not touched any paths of the one that he technically shouldn't have access to out of fear, uh, among many reasons, that he would be banned. And we have seen in the past where if Kabam screws up in a bug and the player takes advantage, uh, they could punish the player. So if you're somebody that's in a similar position and you have access to both quests, I highly recommend that you do not uh, take advantage of it more than you should because Kabam has a historic precedent of potentially banning your account. And under this quarantine time, the last thing you want to do is be banned for this and not be able to play the game that you love. So thanks to everybody who reached out to me to send me similar screenshots about their layout and the bug. Like I said, Kabam is well aware of it. Hopefully they'll find a fix for it, but until then, don't try to exploit it because you would probably, you know, 99% chance wouldn't be able to keep the items anyway. And sometimes when they take away the items, it could result in a temporary or even in a few cases, though hopefully not this one, permanent ban. And that's just not worth the tango of temporary items that you won't get to keep anyway. Thanks for watching YouTube and thanks again to everybody who contacted me wanting me to make this video to let people know of the bug at hand.